There was an interesting moment during Tesla's second quarter 2025 earnings call when Elon Musk was asked about Optimus, Tesla's humanoid robot, and the possibility of hosting another artificial intelligence day. Uh, Elon, though, um, we understand the, the board of directors of a major U.S. investment bank recently toured Optimus production. I, I, that's, I don't know if you want to confirm that or not. It's just what we've heard. That's cool. Um, but when do you think others will be able to get a firsthand view of uh, Optimus like that? Uh, and is the second half of this year too soon to have an AI day? Because it seems like everybody else in the world's doing it and this talent war is getting freaking crazy. And um, I, I, know, I know you've mentioned for recruiting purposes, uh, this is a very important thing that you've done. I think people have, have, you've, have copied you on this. And I'm wondering if this, is, if this year's too early for that. Thanks, Elon. Yeah, it's, it's a bit of a tough thing because like when we do an AI day, we find that some of our competitors have literally done a frame by frame examination of our slides and everything we say, and then copy us. Um, so, you know, I have to say like, well, how, what's the, the trade off? It does help with recruiting, but then competitors look very closely and copy us. Um, I mean, that said, we should probably, I mean, I, I guess we could consider the shareholder meeting to be sort of an, we can do, we can maybe go into depth, some, some amount of depth at the annual shareholder meeting um, with respect to Optimus and AI and uh, sort of that our chip, chip stuff, perhaps. Um, yeah. Uh, Tesla's also really underrated in terms of AI chip design, um, as well as AI software. Um, so, like, there's still not a chip that we would that that exists that we would prefer to put in our car. That is an AI chip that that we would prefer to put in the car over our own. And even though it's been now out for several years, um, and we're confident that the AI five chip will be. Uh, a profound game changer. Um, in fact, it, it, it's so, it's so powerful that we'll, we'll have to nerf it for to some degree for markets outside of the U.S. because it it, it flows way past the, the export restrictions. So unless the export restrictions change, we actually will have to nerf our AI five chip, which is kind of weird. Hopefully, those hopefully we keep you know, raising the bar on export restrictions. Otherwise, it gets a bit silly. Um, but we'll have a bunch of Optimus robots on stage uh, at the shareholder meeting. Um, the Optimus lab is cool to see. It looks like it basically looks like the set of Westworld. Um, you could robots in various stages. Some of them, are, you know, in various stages of repair. Like I don't know, some some, some combination of like the tattooing junkyard and the and Westworld. That's what it looks like. It's very cool. And, and Optimus is walking around the office here in Palo Alto. So just 24 seven is just walking around like it's normal. And, I, and, and we, saw, we saw Optimus like, you know, the Tesla diner serving popcorn. Uh, yeah, so it's, we'll, we'll go from a world where robots are rare to where they're so common that you don't even look up. The question hinted at a rumor that a major United States investment bank's board had recently toured Optimus production. Elon did not confirm it outright, but acknowledged it with a casual, that's cool. What followed was a rare candid take from Elon. He explained that Tesla's past Artificial Intelligence Day events have been helpful for recruiting, but they come with a downside. Competitors, he said, have literally gone frame by frame through Tesla's slides and presentations copying their work closely. It is a tough trade-off, show the world what Tesla is building to attract top talent or stay quiet to protect their competitive edge. Instead of doing another standalone artificial intelligence day, Elon floated an alternative. He suggested that Tesla might include some deep updates on Optimus, artificial intelligence development and chip technology during the company's annual shareholder meeting later this year. This way, they still provide insights and progress 
without giving away too much too soon. The underlying message here was clear. Tesla is pushing forward on Optimus and artificial intelligence, but they are being much more cautious about how and when they reveal their work. With so many companies now chasing artificial intelligence leadership, the pressure to attract top engineers while staying ahead in innovation has never been more intense. Do not forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you never miss an update on Tesla's next big move.